Back in March, Drake dropped a photo of his son, Adonis Graham. And when people initially saw that photo, people were like, what the hell is going on here? I said, Drake then had a whole white baby? You know, that's what people were saying. Now, that caused a big controversy, and a lot of people were discussing at that time period about, see, black people can be um, wiped out of existence by the third generation if that child from that um, interracial relationship have a child with somebody white, look at, you know, Drake's child. So that started a big old controversy. So much so that Drake had to go on this long explanation about how he loved his son and all of that. But you know, what Drake was not talking about was that he had three DNA tests at the time to see if that child was really his, because listen, let's call it what it is. Most men, want their child to come out looking like them. And when Drake seen that baby to take three, three DNA tests. Okay. One, but three. Now he looked at that baby. said, nah, that baby can't be mine. That baby look white. That can't, nah, that baby can't be mine. But no, it came back three times that that baby belongs to Drake because if that baby looked like Drake in the beginning, I'm gonna call it what it is. People can disagree with it or not. I don't care what Drake say because I'm basically off his moves and his actions. If that baby came out looking like him, like the same kind of color or whatever, even close to it and not looking the way the child do look now, um, Drake would have posted that child a lot sooner. Drake knew how y'all would respond. I'm talking about the public. I'm not talking about if you watching this video, when I say y'all, I'm talking about the general public. He knew how the black community would respond to that photo. He knew he wasn't stupid. That's why he took three DNA tests, hoping one of them say the child not his, but Drake, you know, Drake was simping up. Like, see, that's what I understand. The dad simpish. You go fool with some adult film woman, a woman that everybody been with. Like Drake is a man of means. He could have got any beautiful woman he wanted. He could have, I mean, if he go get somebody pregnant, he'll fool Rihanna. Why he didn't get her pregnant? I I'm just saying, um, what stripper he was fooling with at the time? I mean, she's singing, uh, Jahani blaze. I mean, I guess you're getting strippers pregnant. You could have got her pregnant. I guess if you'd have got Jahani blaze pregnant or maybe Rihanna pregnant, your child would have came out looking like you or close to it at least. But that's what it was. I, I, he don't care what he say because he'd have put them pictures out a long time ago. Now I will say this because I just know dudes. If there was a little girl, he would have put the picture out soon. He wouldn't have had a problem with his little girl because of his son. It's a totally different situation, but continuing. I mean, I had, I had to add that people can disagree with what I said just now. Don't care because I know how a lot of us think as men when it comes to our sons, because our son is our legacy. And if he, if his son gets with a white female, he's really done like that child, you know, go really come out like have no resemblance a black whatsoever. None. Now you look at the child or we look at his mom. The child has the same hair color as Drake's mother, curly hair, like his mother. I mean, that child's like a spitting image of his mother, his white mother, white Jewish mother, not his black father, but he was on a radio show as well with Lil Wayne. And he talked about how it was an impromptu for him to show the, the photo. Okay. He says that, Posting a picture was great for him. He said he just wanted to share that uh, with the world. He said he didn't even, wasn't even trying to uh, have everybody talking about it or anything. He said he just playing and he just woke up one morning. He was like, you know what? It's just something I want to do. He said, I want to be able to go place with my son and share memories with my son. He said, and he added, I don't want to feel like because of a life choice I made to be quote unquote, you know, a celebrity that I got to be like, make everyone live underneath this blanket. That could be true, but let's go on the flip side of your action before Drake. Maybe you don't want TMZ to be snapping pictures with you with them and saying, who is this? So you were like, you know what? Let me go ahead and put my son out there. People, let people go ahead and talk about it. At least as I put it out is in a controlled environment. It is what it is right now. That is actually smart. You put it out yourself. Don't let somebody else like try to quote unquote expose you. Now push a T. You know, he's the first one that said that he had a kid though. Nobody knew anything because Drake never put that out there. So he was battling Pusha T uh, two years ago. And Drake got mad that he actually, you know, exposed him. 
And Drake even said that he can't, he can't, you know, squash that with him. He said he, he put it like, I don't want to talk to that person. I said, I bet you, you don't because Pusha T, you know, really handed you your lunch. You, you, you didn't want no more Pusha T Drake. And we all know you didn't want that, but you know, the situation with Drake, he says that he's proud to be a father and, you know, he watched Lil Wayne be a father and all of that. So he want to experience everything with being fatherhood. Listen, his son is his son. I know he love him. Like no one is questioning that, that he loves him. Okay. Nobody. I'm not even questioning that. But what I'm saying is the original thing that people talked about in the beginning, you know, it were black people, you know, can be what they say, quote unquote, bred out. Yeah, you can. I mean, but I mean, look at that situation. You actually can. Um, this is, this is why, at least why I was always told if you are going to, if, if, if you are going to have a child outside the community, don't have one outside the community with a white female. That's like a no, no have one with a woman with some sort of color to her, you know, some, some woman that have some visible color and her people have visible color. If you're going to do something and your child still come out, you know, darker skin tone, if you do so versus you have babies with Becky and then, you know, there you go. Then, then that child have a baby with Becky and then, you know, now you're bred out, you know, but it can, it can happen. You know, I'm not trying to get into that conversation here. That's not the place for it, but I'm just saying that that was the whole conversation at that time period. But Hey, raise your son, Drake, take him, take him to, to um, all the fun places and, um, do all the things that you probably couldn't do as a kid with him. And just, if you want to have a child next time or whatever, try to hook back up Rihanna. I mean, you know, you never know. Uh, you can have, uh, children with her. She talking about, she want to settle down, but well, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about the situation with Drake, you know, and, and how he says that he just enjoys fatherhood. And, and he said it was impromptu for him to put his son out there like that. But like I said, I just personally believe that you feel that you want to get in front of it for TMZ and everybody else outside of push the T um, show, you know, you with your child and everything, but Hey, raise your child, love your child, forget the public. I mean, it's, it's your son. That's all that matters at the end of the day.